You know what's unfair? One tiny pimple leaves a dark mark that can outlive your entire skincare routine. You treat it, exfoliate it, layer brightening serums, and months later, it's still there. Hyperpigmentation isn't just a skin concern. It's a cycle of hope, disappointment, and endless products that promise miracles. But today, we're cutting through the noise. We'll break down five dark spot serums. From the newest tech like La Roche-Posay's Melisil to dermatologist favorites like Cispera to see which ones are actually backed by evidence. Don't forget to subscribe or you might never see us again. The first product is La Roche-Posay Mela B3 Dark Spot Serum. When people first hear about its name, they see two big promises, a brand new molecule called Melisil and dermatologist trusted niacinamide. Together, they form the backbone of what the brand calls its most advanced dark spot technology yet. Let's start with Melisil. This isn't your typical brightening active. After nearly 18 years of research, L'Oreal scientists designed it to catch pigment before it even forms. Chemically, it's 2-mercaptonicotinoyl glycine, and it works by binding to melanin precursors like DHI and DHICA, intercepting them before they polymerize into full pigment. That mechanism was tested in a company-sponsored Melisil Clinical Photo Protection Study, first presented at the 2024 World Congress of Dermatology. According to a report from GCI Magazine, participants using a Melisil-based serum showed visibly less UV-induced darkening after eight weeks. The molecule acts like a pigment interceptor, stopping the process before visible discoloration even develops. And that's what makes it such a big deal in dermatology circles. Next comes niacinamide, or vitamin B3, one of the most scientifically supported ingredients for brightening and tone repair. A clinical trial published in the International Journal of Dermatology compared a 4% niacinamide cream to 4% hydroquinone in patients with melasma and found that both improved dark spots, but niacinamide caused fewer side effects. That research helped establish niacinamide's reputation as a gentle yet effective inhibitor of melanin transfer between pigment cells and skin cells. In Mela B3, the concentration sits around 10%, far higher than the clinical baseline, which means stronger support for tone correction, redness calming, and barrier repair. The formula also includes lipohydroxy acid, LHA, a derivative of salicylic acid that resurfaces the skin's top layer, a split-face clinical study on LHA lotion for photo-aged skin, published in the Journal of Drugs in Dermatology, showed measurable improvements in radiance and texture over six months. This gentle exfoliation helps lift away dull, pigmented cells so new, even-toned skin can surface. Then there's retinal palmitate, a vitamin A ester shown in research from the International Journal of Molecular Sciences to support epidermal renewal and counteract UV-induced pigmentation. Combined with hyaluronic acid, glycerin, and La Roche-Posay's thermal spring water, the formula stays deeply hydrating and calming even for sensitive skin. Now move on to Cispera Intensive Pigment Corrector. When it comes to fighting really stubborn pigmentation, here's where this product steps up. The brand claims it goes beyond traditional brighteners by targeting multiple stages of pigment production and transfer. The hero ingredient is cystamine, a naturally occurring aminothiol that's been studied for its utility in pigment disorders. In the 2020 Skin Research and Technology Study and other trials, the cystamine complex showed roughly a 32% reduction in MMASI, Modified Melasma Area and Severity Index, by week 8, and about 51% by week 16, compared to approximately 23% and approximately 42% for the modified Kligman's formula in one comparison. The mechanism includes inhibition of tyrosinase and peroxidase, chelation of copper iron involved in melanin synthesis, increasing intracellular glutathione, an antioxidant, and reducing melanosome transfer. Next, the complex includes isobionic amide, a derivative of vitamin B3, which appears to enhance cystamine's effect by inhibiting melanosome transfer more effectively than niacinamide in early testing. The formula also uses an AHA component in the three-step system to boost permeability and support surface renewal. In live clinical work, in the double-blind RCT published in the Journal of Drugs in Dermatology, 
comparing the cystamine complex versus modified Kligman's formula in 80 melasma patients, both treatments achieved significant pigment reduction by week 16, with no satisfaction in MMASI or spectrophotometric pigment contrast at each point. Patients using the cystamine complex reported higher satisfaction and better quality of life at week 8 and 16. The third product is Eucerin Radiant Tone Dual Serum. This product is built around a patented molecule that's quietly become one of dermatology's most trusted names in pigment control. Developed after screening over 50,000 potential actives, thiamidol, chemically known as isobutylamidothiazolyl resorcinol, was created by Eucerin scientists to directly inhibit human tyrosinase, the key enzyme that drives melanin production. According to Eucerin's head of research, Dr. Ludger Kolbe, this human-targeted testing makes thiamidol's data far more clinically relevant than traditional brighteners tested only on mushroom tyrosinase. In several internal and peer-reviewed studies, thiamidol has demonstrated comparable tyrosinase inhibition to hydroquinone, but with significantly lower irritation potential. A 2019 trial published in the Journal of Investigative Dermatology reported a 75% reduction in hyperpigmentation intensity after 12 weeks of thiamidol use when combined with SPF, compared to placebo-treated sites. Beyond its core molecule, the dual serum format integrates two chambers, one containing thiamidol and the other infused with concentrated hyaluronic acid for deep hydration and plumping. This dual action allows the skin to recover faster while improving the penetration of the active, keeping the formula tolerable enough for daily use. In a brand-led product-in-use test with 120 participants aged 25 to 55, 84% reported brighter, more even skin within two weeks, and 97% saw improvement by week four, confirming both rapid and cumulative benefits. With that foundation, the Eucerin Anti-Pigment Dual Serum positions itself as the dermatologist's daily weapon. Precise, clinically grounded, and ideal for those who want visible results without complex regimens. Next, Murad Rapid Dark Spot Correcting Serum. The hero of this formula is patented Resorcinol Technology, a branded term by Murad, built around resorcinol derivatives, specifically 4-ethyl resorcinol and other resorcinols which research shows are potent inhibitors of tyrosinase, the key enzyme in melanin synthesis. For example, a study titled Mechanistic Studies of Anti-Hyperpigmentary Compounds found that 4-ethyl resorcinol significantly attenuated both tyrosinase enzyme action and melanin production in culture. The serum also incorporates tranexamic acid, a synthetic derivative that has gained major attention in pigment research. One RCT, Topical 5% tranexamic acid for the treatment of melasma in Asians found that a 5% topical TA formulation resulted in meaningful reduction in pigmentation versus baseline over 12 weeks. In Murad's case, tranexamic acid works to calm pigment-triggering inflammation and reduce melanin transfer and deposition. Finally, it layers in glycolic acid, an AHA whose role is well-established, exfoliating the surface layers of skin accelerating turnover so pigmented cells can be shed faster. Murad's own product claims that within 14 days, 84% showed a reduction in the look of dark spots. Limitations. Before we talk about texture, it's worth acknowledging what none of these serums fully escape, the clinical gaps. While La Roche-Posay's Mela B3 brings exciting multi-patented tech with Melasil, most of its data still comes from early in-house studies. We're waiting for large peer-reviewed trials to confirm how it performs across skin tones and chronic pigment conditions like melasma. Cispera Intensive has some of the strongest published evidence, but most trials are short-term, up to 16 weeks, and often brand-funded. The rinse-off format also makes user compliance a real-world variable that studies can't fully capture. For Eucerin's dual serum, Thiamidol's research is well-documented and dermatologist-led, but many studies use combined regimens with SPF or day creams, making it hard to isolate the serum's independent effect. And Murad's Rapid Dark Spot Correcting Serum 
though built on strong, well-known actives like resorcinol and tranexamic acid, doesn't yet have independent clinical papers on the full formula, only studies on the ingredients themselves. Let's discuss what users have to say about these products. La Roche-Posay's Mela B3 Serum has drawn over 8,500 global reviews on Amazon, with an average of 4.3 stars. Across the board, users rave about its lightweight, silky texture. It sinks in fast, layers well with moisturizer and sunscreen, and leaves no greasy feel. It's also praised for being exceptionally gentle, even on sensitive or rosacea-prone skin, with most saying it brightens without any burning or peeling. When it comes to results, the consensus is gradual but real. Consistent use over four to eight weeks brings a noticeably more even tone, especially for acne marks and mild sun damage. Still, it is said to work slowly. Many say it takes two bottles or more to see clear fading. And second, the small bottle size makes it feel pricey for the time it takes to deliver. Cispera Intensive Pigment Corrector has a far smaller presence on Amazon US compared to other dark spot treatments, just 94 global ratings with an average 3.7 star score. The reviews are sharply divided when it comes to effectiveness. Some users swear by it, saying their dark spots visibly lightened after two to three months of daily use, with one noting that, it's very effective. I saw results within weeks. Others, however, express frustration, calling it ineffective and overpriced, with comments like, bought two versions, it didn't work, and every day my melasma got darker and darker using this. In short, the sentiment around Cispera is polarized, a mix of slow but steady believers and disappointed skeptics, reflecting its niche, dermatology-driven positioning, and the patience it demands compared to faster-acting serums like Mela B3. The Radiant Tone Dual Serum currently holds 1,093 global reviews on Amazon, with a strong 4.4 star average rating. Most users agree on one thing. It genuinely helps fade dark spots and brightens overall skin tone when used consistently. Reviewers highlight how well it layers under moisturizer and makeup, making it an easy addition to daily routines. Many love its silky, non-greasy texture and say it absorbs smoothly, leaving the skin feeling soft and hydrated. However, feedback on the scent and sensitivity is split. Some find the fragrance pleasant, while others call it too strong. A few users with reactive skin mention mild irritation, though many report no issues at all. Lastly, Murad's Rapid Dark Spot Correcting Serum has earned 1,833 global reviews on Amazon, averaging a 4.2 star rating. Most users praise its visible results, saying it helps fade dark spots and smooth out skin texture within weeks. Many also note that their skin feels softer and brighter, especially when used consistently with sunscreen. A number of reviewers call it worth every penny, crediting it for restoring glow and clarity to dull, uneven skin. That said, opinions on value and sensitivity are mixed. Some feel it's overpriced for the results, while others find the payoff well worth it. Experiences with irritation vary, too. Several users report zero issues, while a few mention mild rashes or itching. As for the scent, reactions are split. Some find it pleasant, Others say it fades quickly and isn't a deal breaker. Now let's check the price benchmark. At the top of the price spectrum sits Sisley, Lintegral Anti-Age Radiance and Dark Spot Serum, retailing at around 530 US dollars for 30 milliliters. That's roughly $17.6 per milliliter, positioning it firmly in the ultra luxury category. On the opposite end, the Axis Y Dark Spot Correcting Glow Serum costs about $17.99 for 50 milliliters, or just 36 cents per milliliter, a popular budget favorite known for its niacinamide and plant-derived brighteners. Against this scale, our four contenders fall comfortably in the mid-premium range. La Roche-Posay Mela B3 Serum, approximately $45 for 30 milliliters, which is $1.50 per milliliter, 
Sispera Intensive Pigment Corrector, approximately $170 for 30 milliliters, making it $5.67 per milliliter. Eucerin Radiant Tone Dual Serum, approximately $40 for 30 milliliters, which is $1.33 per milliliter. Murad Rapid Dark Spot Correcting Serum, approximately $75 for 30 milliliters, making it $2.50 per milliliter. In other words, while none of them reach Sisley's couture pricing, they're notably above the drugstore average, balancing dermatologist-grade actives with accessible luxury. So here's the verdict. First place goes to La Roche-Posay's Mela B3 Serum. It's the best all-rounder. Combining cutting-edge pigment interception tech with proven niacinamide and gentle exfoliation, Real users back it up too, praising its comfort and visible, steady tone correction. It's evidence-led, elegant, and works across skin types. The most balanced, dermatologist-trusted pick in this lineup. Second is Eucerin's Radiant Tone Dual Serum. Thiamidol isn't new, but it's one of the few brighteners with serious, human-based clinical data. The serum's dual-chamber format makes it both potent and hydrating, and the reviews confirm consistent fading and glow. If you want something dermatologist-grade and reliable, this one earns its spot right behind La Roche-Posay. Third goes to Murad's Rapid Dark Spot Correcting Serum. It delivers fast surface results with resorcinol, glycolic acid, and tranexamic acid, but it leans slightly more aggressive. You'll see visible brightness quickly, but it's pricier and may not suit sensitive skin. Ideal for those who want speed over subtlety. And last, Sispera Intensive Pigment Corrector. Scientifically, it's strong. Cystiamine has data behind it, but the rinse-off routine, sulfuric scent, and polarized reviews make it a niche treatment for those willing to commit. It's the dermatologist's power tool, not the everyday user's serum. If you found this breakdown helpful, don't forget to hit subscribe, because next, we're testing whether combining these actives actually speeds results or ruins your barrier. And don't forget to check the description for the link to these products. Stay tuned, keep your SPF close, and remember, good skin isn't luck, it's chemistry.